anime is a psyop. I'll keep this video short, it comes directly after I don't watch anime anymore. But it is one of the reasons why I don't really watch anime, because I genuinely believe that anime is a psyop. Because you live by character through the characters. I speak, I speak by character a lot, I speak by character fucking a lot on this channel. But yeah, it's one of those, it's the same media which you live by character through the characters, which you've never experienced. Like, a lot of, of not even, like, harem type animes will have, like, a small harem, or, like, two, three girls that literally fawn over the main character because in real life you, you get no fucking bitches and you get zero and you see this guy and you live in this, in, this, in this thing get multiple bitches and he doesn't even touch them because if he did touch them you'd feel a way something about it as well because usually very female weak men watch this shit and then like it's, it's, it's a weird paradigm I think it's all a psyop and it's all a lie and I'm kind of attacking multi-billion dollar industry here but and it was my childhood as well, which is even worse. But I think that gives me more qualifications to talk about it because it's a lie that I fell into. I live like a back hurts. But let me do the Brian Johnson posture fix. Uh, I'm feeling my fucking spine really loudly. Oh, it feels nice. Whoa, oh, my head feels light as well. Spinal fluid. Sure, like kind of just forcibly readjusting itself. This is, uh, is new. You know, it was much harder for a very, very long time. No, it's kind of just gone. All of it. I don't live with it now. If I was starting a business ten years ago, when I was seven years old, and then today I'm seventeen, I would reap all the fucking rewards for my business, and I'll be a multi-millionaire at eighteen because of ten years of entrepreneurship experience. I can't say the same with anime, 10 years of watching anime, you're just a fucking mega geek. <laughs> the fuck? It's a psyop, it's a lie, I have nothing else to say. I could I could definitely develop my argument more if there's only one guy like, well, but anime has helped my life and, and, you know, uh, shut the fuck up, bro. That doesn't help your life. You sat down, you watched a Japanese cartoons for 20 minutes per episode, and you watched it for like 12, it's only 12 uh, episodes in a season, and you, and you may, may, may have, or may or not have, binge watched the entire three seasons. Spent countless hours watching this shit. It's time to stop. It's time to get blind by the balls and man up. The fuck? And you might not agree with this message now, because if 10 years, no, a few years ago when I was watching anime and I watched a video like this, like, some people like, you need to man up, stop being a bitch. I'm gonna be truthfully honest, I probably would have reacted to this video very, very negatively. I'd be like, oh yeah, he's a bitch, he's a liar, and uh, dislike the video. But like, I'll, in a few years' time, I'll recent visit the video when I'm a bit more mature and I think, like, yeah, I should have listened to this guy. And I, I want you to speed run that in a few years and just do it now instead of a few years, instead of spending a few years. Because if you, for example, like five, five years later you come back to this video, you're like, oh shit, Jimmy was right. Jimmy, sh Jimmy told me the truth. Jimmy, Jimmy said fix my life. I should have fixed my life five years ago because if, if I was uh, fixing fix my life five years ago, I would be okay today. Jimmy, Jimmy cared for me in the sense. Jimmy doesn't even know me, but he cares for me. He tried to give me the best possible advice he can. I don't know you specifically, but I, I would like to give you the best advice for you can to so change your fucking life and not be like fucking wasting video game time, enemy time, jumping off time, like me. Don't make the same mistakes as me, because it fucking sucks making mistakes. But you will make mistakes, they will come, but if you can mitigate as much as possible, it would be very, very nice. <laughs> it would be very, very nice. And anime is one of the style, but you need to avoid it. Yeah, I probably would have reacted to this video negatively, admittedly. I mean, the truth. Because um, I was a fucking loser, and I think anyone that's telling you with good intentions to, you know, stop using entertainment media and have stuff to fix your life, and they react negatively, are so stuck in the system, it's very, very difficult to help them in the very, very moment. But I think the best way is just ask them questions and show them the reality. It's like a, like a god showing a, uh, like a disbeliever of like a, a vision of hell, and then it becomes a believer and it becomes a devout uh, Christian or devout Muslim thereafter. That's like the paradigm that's happening. And I think that's the paradigm that a lot of young men need to go through. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Let me, let me know because I may have an amazing style. Don't fall for the anime trap. Love you guys. It's the end of the video, man.